Okay, this is my replication of the step-by-stepper motor that uh, Tin Man got started. And uh, before I show you what we've got, I want to thank the lead motor for the sourcing this little stepper motor. And I want to thank uh, Slider for, for bringing up the Imhotep Bedini SSG PC Fan Radiant Charger. Because that's basically what this circuit is. I'm using a uh, MJE 13007 transistor, two diodes, they're 1N4007. Uh, I've got a neon light on there, and that's it. Uh, right now, I'm running from a 6 volt power supply. At uh, 6 volts, this, uh, this little stepper motor is running at 528 RPM. And that is being generated by about a hundred and sixty milliamps draw and you can see right here it's sort of hard to tell but uh, the neon is flashing and uh, so here here's the motor running on six volts now let's swap this over to a 12 volts and excuse me here this is kind of clumsy. Okay, the motor stopped, so we'll give it a little spin to start. So there it's running at 12 volts. At 12 volts, it's running 1,368 RPM. And it's using 105, roughly, milliamps. Uh, that's a 1 amp meter. So it's, it's using about 105 milliamps to run this little stepper motor uh, off of 12 volts. And uh, not quite triple the speed of the 6 volt. Okay, so one more time. Let's change up our battery configuration. I've got these batteries set up in series. So now we'll have 18 volts going to this motor and we'll give it a start and there it is running at 18 volts. Now that's 4,290 RPM and the current draw is about 90 milliamps, pretty close to 100 milliamps, but about 90, 95 maybe. So. And there's there's our neon just just going away. I forgot to show it to you at 12 volts, but it was slightly less bright at 12. So you can see each step up in six volts increases the RPM, drops the current, and does a better job of lighting the neon on the back side. And again, that's just one transistor and two diodes. There's no, no resistors, nothing else in that circuit. That is the Imhotep Bedini SSG PC Fan Radiant Charger circuit with the variable resistor removed from that circuit. So anyway, that's, that's my replication of this. Thanks, thanks to all the guys that are working on it. And, uh, this has been a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed this video.